Yo, what is up guys? Brandon here from Red Black Productions and today I'm gonna teach you how to change your RAM on your MacBook. So first we're gonna need is of course your MacBook itself, along with a precision screwdriver set to screw all those tiny screws behind our MacBook, and of course our choice of DDR3 RAM. I'll be using the 4GB DDR3 RAM by Corsair. So first let's go ahead and grab our MacBook. So now we grabbed our MacBook, let's go ahead and flip it over to the back. It doesn't really matter if your MacBook's backplate looks like this or not, because this is indeed an older model made in 2007. But first what we're going to do is get our trusty screwdriver from our precision kit and unscrew everything we see on our MacBook. Next what we're going to do is lift up that lever to reveal the second base plate off, take that off and unscrew everything like we did in the first step. And now that we've finished screwing all those screws that's keeping that MacBook's intact, we can go ahead and lift up that backplate off, revealing what's inside our MacBook. So this is pretty much what your MacBook looks like inside, with our battery, circuit board, RAM, hard drive, and disk drive. So this green chip left of the center is our RAM. So to take it out, there should be two prongs on the sides. What we're gonna do is very slightly just pull them apart and the RAM should just pop right out. Now we do the same thing with that bottom piece where we pull apart those two prongs, keeping it together, and the RAM should just pop right out. The bottom piece is always more difficult than the first, so be careful when pulling them out and not to break or touch anything. Okay, so putting it in is exactly the same as our first step of taking it out, but in reverse. We're gonna go and line up our bottom so it fits in the slot and make sure we insert it on an angle. Then just push down until we hear a click and it's right in. And we do this again for the top piece where we line up our bottom, then make sure to insert it on an angle and then just press it down until we hear a click where the prongs have connected it, leaving it intact. And now we're done. That's pretty much all you need to know about changing our RAM on our MacBook. So let's go ahead and put everything back together by putting our base plate on and screwing all those screws back together. So just a reminder, this is indeed an old MacBook, not a pro, just a plain old MacBook, the aluminium edition that was made in 2007 by Apple. So of course, obviously the newer MacBooks or the MacBook Pros, the backing won't look like this where it has two part of a back plate as well as the disk drive or the arrangement of our circuit board, but the principle still applies the same where we go and lift up those prongs of our RAM and insert it back in. So that was pretty much how to insert RAM on a MacBook and I'll see you guys soon. Laters!